As always, a nice room here at Best Western, and the best part is we actually got this one for free using our Best Western reward points. You basically earn them every time you stay, and from anywhere from 8,000 to 36,000 points, you can stay at one of the many 4,000 locations all across the world. After exploring the city for a day, we're now off to find and try some of the best drinks in the state of Oregon. Right now, we're actually only a half hour from the famous Willamette Valley, which is home to over 19,000 acres of vineyards and over 500 plus wineries. So obviously that's our first place to start. Let's go. So we made it to the Willamette Valley. We're here at the Irie Vineyards getting ready for our first wine tasting of the day. We're here at Stoller Family Estates, one of the most beautiful wineries in all of Oregon. Voted number one tasting room by USA Today in the entire country. So let's go try some wines. The wine tasting was delicious. We're now off to the coast. After some wine tasting, we're now at our next destination, Newport, and we're staying at the Best Western Plus Agat Beach, which welcomes us with more wine as they have a wine reception every day from 5 to 6. And as always, we have a beautiful room and outstanding amenities, and in this case, we have a beautiful view of the Oregon coast. So we've made it to the Rogue Brewery here in Newport. We're just waiting on our tour. Just waiting for, oh no, it's beer o'clock. Let's go. <laughs> now we're about to try some of the beers. This is the best way to do it, I think. Get like a sample of a bunch because you can't just have one there's too many and this one's the Marion Berry Cider I'd never heard of that before it's a local berry from this area which is pretty amazing oh, it's so good. after tasting some amazing beer we couldn't live without bringing some to our next destination Ben Bend is known for all kinds of hiking trails. You can go see waterfalls, you can see lava, but there's also something else they're known for, the Bend Ale Trail. There's lots of breweries in the area, so when you come here, come to the visitor center, grab your Bend Ale Trail passport, then you can get stamps at each different brewery that's in the town, and if you get enough stamps, you get a free gift, so let's get going. As part of our Ale Trail experience, we're first gonna learn how beer is made at one of the most iconic breweries in all of Bend, the Schutz Brewery. Welcome to Deschutes Brewery, the oldest brewery in Bend. We started in 1988. We make a variety of styles of beer, and let's go check out how we make beer. Smells like beer. One more! So first we went to the actual Crater Lake. Now we're at Crater Lake Spirits Tasting Room where they make locally crafted spirits including vodka, gin and whiskey. Cheers! 
So here is my choice of drink which I put on a little piece of paper and they recommend to go from the lightest to the darkest or the sweetest alcohol. So let's start with this one, which is the Crater Lake Reserve Vodka. You can feel it. <laughs> Love it. I drank all of them. And now the dessert one, which is the Crater Lake Hazelnut Espresso Vodka. Oh my god, super good! We're almost there. Last one. of the Ben L Trail and we got this cool prize which is a silly pine which doesn't break so we hope you enjoyed this video about the best drinks of the state of Oregon as you know we started off in the Willamette Valley tasting some of the best wines before moving to the coast to taste some of the best beers and now we're here in Ben touring some of the best distilleries and breweries it's a fitting way to end our tour of the best drinks of Oregon cheers, cheers.